Hey, it's Tim from Income TV, and let's try to understand what the Bitcoin wallet is all about. To make things easy for you to comprehend, we're going to use the analogy of an email to explain the idea. Just like you have a unique email address that's only one in the world, you are given a unique address that others will use to send you the Bitcoin. Let's say this address is called the Bitcoin address, your Bitcoin address. Just like you can share your email address publicly, you can share your Bitcoin address too. It does not have to be hidden or secret. I and mean, think about how can someone send you something if you don't give them your address. Now, what do you do when you want to see an email you have just received? Well, the first thing you do is open the email service you use, for example, Gmail, Hotmail, Yahoo, etc. If you want to know how many Bitcoin you have in the wallet, you will first have to go to a Bitcoin client. So think about what do you do when you open, let's say, the Gmail login page. Of course, you enter your login details, i.e. your email address and password. So just like that, when you've accessed your Bitcoin client, you will need to enter the login details, which in the case of a Bitcoin wallet includes your Bitcoin address and private key. Now, do you share your personal email password with people? Of course not. Same thing with your Bitcoin wallet. The private key you have used along with your Bitcoin address to know how many Bitcoin you have is to be kept private. You want to store your Bitcoin address and private key somewhere. You could write it down on a piece of paper and keep it hidden somewhere. In that case, the piece of paper will be your Bitcoin wallet. You could use an app designed to store the Bitcoin address and private key. This app is called a Bitcoin wallet. In fact, if you can memorize your Bitcoin address and private key, which I don't suggest, your brain will now become the Bitcoin wallet. To make things easier for people to manage, most of the programs that are Bitcoin wallets are also the Bitcoin clients. What this means is that they will store your Bitcoin private key and address, as well as let you send Bitcoin to other people. It's like you can use Gmail not only to send emails, but to also store your password. And think about how do you store a password in Gmail? You might write it in an email and send that email to yourself, but in this particular case, you're improvising, i.e. you're using the email to store the password. Now, Gmail doesn't have a specific service that lets you store your passwords within your Gmail account. But in the case of Bitcoin clients, they're intrinsically designed to provide you both services. For example, not only does Coinbase.com allow you to store your Bitcoin address and private key acting as a Bitcoin wallet, but it also acts as a client helping you send your Bitcoin to others. So that's it. Hopefully we've kept things simple for you and now you understand what a Bitcoin wallet is. If you found this video helpful, please be sure to leave a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, be sure to click the circular image in the upper right hand corner of the screen and tick the bell icon to get notified whenever we release more new videos to help you increase your income. Go ahead and check out some additional money making videos right now on the left side of the screen. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.